All right, we've got a Lenovo here. Now this one is a bit tricky. One of my friends on YouTube recommended that I, this is gonna be part two by the way, check the SIO, <coughs> Super IO. Check the connections from Super IO to the keyboard. One of them, one of the channels, one of the traces may be damaged. Now I was told by the client that they simply rotated the screen all the way and this problem started to happen. The problem is some of the keys work, some do not work. You replace them with another keyboard, brand new one. So being brand new, we can understand there may be sometimes faults, maybe one or two keys not working, but it's the exact same keys that are not working. So that tells us there is a problem with the board, somewhere on the board, with the connection to Super I.O. <coughs> Or client is not telling us exactly what happened to this unit. <coughs> so let's have the charger. Let me see the number. I do know the battery is a bit low. Okay, so I'm not going to waste time. I'm just going to take this back cover off. Off. I don't know why, but these guys are very sticky. Okay. So initially, I thought I'll just make a video on replacing the keyboard while the customer is waiting. which was not to be. Super I is on the other side, bummer, okay. Okay. Let's take the keyboard out. So I learned my lesson, this model. Just push it to the right. I think it should come out. Concern about here to there. Mm, okay, 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 okay. There we go, that's our problem. Sometimes, you know, people are not telling the full truth. So let's have a look. Uh, microscope. Okay, let's have a look. Of course. Something to do with super I.O. Okay, so 
that's the well, what, what is that? What the hell is that? Is that liquid? What's this? Is there flux? No. How come it's on each corner? Is that from factory? In each corner, I don't think that's a problem. Why, why on each corner? What the hell is going on there? Will that come out? Never seen that before. Maybe that's nothing. That's normal. Okay, let's give it a clean. Let's put some alcohol. Let's get the brush. I doubt that's the issue. But I've never seen such a liquid on four corners. Which doesn't make sense. Not sure, but still, just clean these guys. I doubt there is anything wrong there. The intake key would not work before, so I can't even get into BIOS. Yes, this worked. Huh? <clears throat> F1. F1 worked. No way. Enter works. Hallelujah. Go to date and time. I'm gonna set the date and time. Zero one zero three. Look at that. The problem is fixed. Wow. Twenty twelve. I couldn't tap that before. Tab wouldn't work before. Good. Okay. Let's reboot. Wow. What an interesting problem. <clears throat> so if it is liquid, we're going to assume it's liquid. 
I don't think we got a pin number for this. Okay, they may have a guest account, let's see. So we checked that may may not work. Touch screen. One, one is now working. Backspace working. Before they will not work. Yeah. Yeah. Great. Sign in options. I'm gonna type. I'm gonna try the password. Shift. Yep. Shift works. Shift all the way. Two, four, six, eight. 10, yep. Yep. Wonderful. Problem is fixed. So why, why did this happen? If liquid was the problem, maybe it seeped in from the side. Somehow. Okay. Whatever it is, Maybe it's fixed. Now let's connect these guys because the middle button didn't work either, the little mouse. Let's see if that's part of the problem. Okay, and nipple mouse is also working, so you can see the bottom, yep. Before it wouldn't move, now it does, okay. Yeah, hallelujah. Brightness, yep. Definitely liquid, yeah, most likely definitely liquid. Some time ago, I don't know. We just don't have a clear answer, we don't know. Yep, sweet. Brightness works too. Well, there we go. That's the end of the video. So I'll publish the video when the client accepts the quote. Otherwise, this goes in the archives, released in the future. See you in the next time, next video.